Hey, uh, welcome back on the show. The Dr. Phil Show, I'm glad to have you. Thank you. Today we're going to be playing Skate 3. This is a prophecy foretold. What? What, what prophecy? Prophecy of the Dr. Phil Show. Sexy vegan is going to save the world. Alright, so if you can't tell, we've been playing a little bit off camera. Well, we had this already for a while. Um, did we kill the king, queen slime on camera? We did, but I forgot to post the video. But, um, okay, so, this is our home. This is the outside, this is my home, the outside. And then, I got a fire wand and a hat, and these are my family, this is my family. Here's my mom, here's my brother, here's my sister. I mean, my dad. Yeah, sure. I guess. And this is my bunny. He's the only friend I've ever had. Now, yeah, now Dr. Phil is a cute little bee. Yep. I want to make this heal. How do you make the fire? Great. Make the fire. And this is the example of this. Alright, well, I need to Alright, so while that's getting made. Hey, Dr. Phil, what's today's episode going to be about on the Dr. Phil show? Well, uh, like I said, we're going to be playing uh, Skate 3. Mm -hmm. So, um, last time we learned how to make jelly juice. Mm -hmm. And on this episode of Cooking with Dr. Phil, we're going to be making raviolis. Raviolis? I thought we were playing Skate 3. Homemade raviolis. You can make raviolis in TA3. Oh, yeah. So, uh, we're gonna be going to the boss world because we need not, we just need the finest ingredients for our raviolis. We can't go to the boss world yet. Yes, we're yes, we're we one can. portal away. We can go to the boss key world, but we can't. Boss go key there. world then. What the heck's going on over here? Jade Stone Merchant. We'll do that later. See, we're close to getting the boss. So, uh, let's go to the boss key world then. Hold on, let me make some stuff. We need the finest ingredients. Well, sorry to my viewers, but because November here is an idiot, we can't go to the boss world to get the finest ingredients. So we're going to have to make a slight change in our recipe. I'll tell you what to replace it with, though. Let's just go to the world before the boss world, and we'll go to the boss world. Go to the So... You'll uh, just take a you know leisurely trip down to the grocery store at Shrieking Sands. Yep. I know not everyone has a fancy portal like us, but any portal should do. Yep. Is our portal especially fancy? No. I wonder if they can hear me or not. Wait, no, weren't you shouldn't have said that because that's what Trump said. Those seed. I am. So, see this? Uh, oh, whoa! <laughs> so you see, you may fall down a giant chasm like I did, and if you saw okay. in front of me, there was a Native American named Shumba. Okay, so we actually have to come down here to search for the. Um. So, you see these monkey looking fellas? All you need is 10,000 monkey hearts. 10,000 monkey hearts. For the homemade raviolis, Dr. Phil style. Alrighty. And you're gonna want this giant tentacle altar. Oh, yes. That, that gives it a nice space. Ow. I mean, spice. Fireball. How much mana does that take up? Ow! Oh my god, what is that? Why is there one of the bo mini bosses here? That's like the thing I thought on that other world. Okay, well. I just. Can't that. That's what Trump Yeah, you see those guys down there? Um, the giant octopus fellows? Yes. 
You see, uh, we don't really need them uh, until we make the fried raviolis. Don't even get me a start on the fried raviolis. Do I need raviolis. the skull for so the raviolis? That's a whole different story. Do I need the skull for the raviolis? I mean, it's not part of the recipe, but you can grind it out to make a nice, nice spice. Well, like, kind of like Parmesan cheese put on it. So, you see, you're going to go down, and uh, the trick is to not fall down the chasm. Yeah. I never knew. So, you're going to skip right past this chasm, build your own bridge. Yeah, I know it may seem like a hassle. I know, I know. And I thought so at first as well. However... You're just gonna want these 10,000 monkey hearts. I hate how you mail like a sheep when you die. Time flies by really fast. So, uh, once you die, which is, oh, you're just gonna not get hit by his energy balls. I'm making your, your movements very erratic, which is not helping me much. You're supposed to come down the castle. Not to get these fried raviolis. I mean, normal raviolis. Fried raviolis is different. I'm, so I'm trying to get the, uh, relic. A relic, relic. I'm looking for a level for this. Does this give me a light? It does not. Does this? Does this? It does! Yay, my fire wand gives me light. Right, I'm just gonna go this fast. That's the relic I need! Okay, perfect. So, if you think of getting 10,000 of the Schwumba yeah. monkey hearts, um, if you think it's uh, maybe a bit too, you know, uh, troublesome, then you could get this um, cursed scroll. What? Uh, How did you get that? The raviolis. That Dude, is this... actually a very prime ingredient. I'm surprised Do we got I have it in the place like that. my mask? I don't want it. So, um, Are you gonna keep it? Yeah! That's to start off. That's the uh, that's the first part of the ravioli. Then you're just gonna sprinkle in a little salt. Okay. Wait, what do you want me to do? You're just gonna sprinkle in a little salt, like here. Uh, verted down real dust. But well, normal salt works as well. Um, you're just not gonna get the same thing. And then, uh, add in a few carrots. Roughly three whole carrots. And, uh,. And if you really want to be extra, you could put in a pumpkin there as well. And uh, then you got your homemade raviolis. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. That's easy, quick, delicious homemade raviolis. It has actually been approved by Gordon Ramsay himself. In fact, he actually gave up all of his cooking career when he tasted my homemade raviolis and said that I deserve to be the new Gordon Ramsay, so... This is practically the same as hearing from Gordon Ramsay. And then the wolves came. Wolves? Yep. You gonna attack me still? You guys are. Find the leader cultists. Trade the citrus vessels for the high cultists. Zebo for the worm totem piece. I don't want to. I like this mouse. What the? Why is he spazzing out? Alright, what do you need for the raviolis? Lord. Oh, did you just hear? We finished, dude. We got the first scroll, some carrots, and some salt. Wait, didn't you need the skull? Uh, you can crush it up and make like a Parmesan cheese. Alright, there you go. So, I mean, I guess. Uh, it's already broken, so, yeah. easy. Um, 
Now, if you want fried raviolis, that is an entirely different news story. You, you see, we just don't have enough time to do this episode, but stay tuned. We're gonna pop, I'm trying to get a movie in theaters coming soon about how to make uh, the fried raviolis, and uh, just just waiting on like copyright stuff, you know. Yes. Oh, and uh, while well, I have your attention, speaking of raising money and waiting on copyright, uh, there is a friend of mine that started a GoFundMe. I'd love you guys all to check out. We'll link it in the description. See, he's trying to save up enough money, uh, enough money to buy a new credit card. Uh, he ordered his credit card, and when it got in the mail, it was um, a Disney Princess card. Because he just <laughs> asked for a random one. So he needs a new one, and uh, that's where we're all going to come in. Um, I think he said he needed roughly $10,000. So, it is a uh, great, and now if you're wondering which Disney princess, um... Was it Elsa? It is Elsa. Uh, no, it's actually, it's, I, I think it's her sister, Frozen, from Elsa. I'm not entirely which, sure which one is Frozen. Uh, if it's the girl with the blue dress, then yeah, it's Frozen. Yeah, that's, um, Elsa. Oh. So it's Frozen the Snowman? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Jeez, I use this so much mana. Yeah, we'll link we'll link the GoFundMe in the description. I found a portal. Okay. It might lead to the boss world. The boss world, that's where we get the uh, stuff for uh, fried raviolis. What are you doing? Time to end this episode. Uh, All right. Thank you. This has been uh, this has been Skate Three with Doctor Phil. Yep. All right. So, well, I should. We're probably gonna post another video later today. Peace.